Now, breaking news from RTV6. More breaking news to tell you about this midday. Three people are charged in connection with a lottery scam. The Marion County prosecutor says they were involved with a fraudulent claim involving a scratch-off ticket. RTV6 reporter Julie Persley is live outside the Hoosier Lottery Office downtown with the latest. Julie. Three people are now under arrest in connection with this case, and the charges were filed yesterday. The Marion County prosecutor just wrapped up a news conference to explain exactly how all this went down. The prosecutor's office says Parsley Liquors in Plainfield was a former Hoosier Lottery retailer. The lottery status was suspended for that store in July of last year because of the pending sale of Parsley Liquors after the owner died. Some lottery items remained at the store, including a pack of $20 scratch-off lottery tickets. Investigators say the former manager, Jackie Parsley, activated the tickets. Keep in mind, now an employee and their family members cannot get a ticket from that store. They tell us that seven tickets were redeemed from the packet in the amounts from $20 to $50. Then in October, Ashley Campbell, the fiance of Jackie Parsley's brother, Joseph Parsley, presented a winning $2 million ticket to the Hoosier Lottery. Now, Jackie Parsley, Joseph Parsley, and and his now wife, Ashley Campbell Parsley, are all charged in this case. When she was interviewed, uh, she claimed that she had purchased that ticket on October 1st at Parsley Liquors. As set forth in the probable cause affidavit, uh, video from Parsley Liquors demonstrates that no such purchase was made on that date. Now, again, the owner of Parsley Liquors, formerly in Plainfield, had passed away, and it was an, ex an estate executor that first notified police saying that he had heard that a winning lottery ticket came from that business. That started the ball rolling in this investigation. That's what led police, the Marion County Prosecutor's Office, and the lottery to revealing all of this information. We'll have more story, more on this story throughout the day. Reporting live downtown, Julie Parsley. RTV6.